Hi, it's T with T Quilts, and today is Tuesday, July 27th, 2021. And we, when I say we, Kevin and I, we are about to embark on the Iowa State Shop Hop. And it is, let's see, 4.45 a.m. I left, I woke up at 3 a.m. this morning, left my house at 3.30 a.m. And I am at Kevin's house. We've got his stuff packed. He's locking up and we are about to get on the road. So we will hopefully see you guys at the first quilt shop. Or I may just pop in and uh, let you all see Kevin too. But I just wanted to do an intro to this video. in what part of Iowa? Cantrill. Cantrill, Iowa, <laughs> at the Dutchman store, the old time general store. And we are here with Kevin the Quilter. We started our journey and it is about 7.35. We got here about 7.30 and they open at 8 a.m. So we are ready to rock and roll. Kevin has a goal on this trip. What's your goal? I would like to visit 30 shops in three days. <laughs> so 30 <laughs> shops, well, four days, because we've got... Four days, correct. And we got to get back home on the fourth day yeah. as well. So we got four days to visit 30 shops, and we even talked about some museum. Yes. The, the quilt, Iowa there's a quilt, quilt Museum. The Iowa Quilt Museum. So we don't know if we're going to make it to that, but our goal is that we're trying to get to that as well. So we shall see how this all works. So you all know our goal and we'll see exactly what happens. Let me uh, show you the place here. So, so here we are, there's that store sign and then this is their storefront. Like I said, it's a general store. So it spans the entire side of this block. And my car is blocking the rest of it, but this general store is all one business on this side. So I'll come back to you with my next clip. Because I can see we got problems. We got failure to communicate. You tells me that I can pick a card, and now I can't pick a card. You're telling me which card to open. When to open birthday gifts, it's not my birthday yet, but I gotta open the birthday gift. And I gotta open a card. You gonna open a card in your gift, or you gonna sit there and talk? What card is that card? <laughs> <laughs> my what card? That card. That card, I hold it. Okay, to the reigning queen of scraps, Miss T. Of course. You know who that is? I don't know who this is from. <laughs> Alright. Oh my god. <laughs> it's getting 3D. <laughs> Birthdays are like underwear. <laughs> uh, they can be wild and exciting or just plain stinky. <laughs> they can creep up on you or feel like a pain in the butt. And when you've had them long enough, there's some sagging, wrinkling, and general breakdown of elasticity. <laughs> Hope yours is colorful and fun, just like your quilt. Now that's funny, because we were on the conversation of underwear. I know that was cracking you up in the car. <laughs> it's amazing the topics that we get on. That is too funny. And uh, to see happy birthday. Pretty girl, have a great day, love, Mike. I can't believe I get to spend your birthday. 
birthday with you doing what we love to do, quilt shop hopping. Thanks for your friendship. Let's make your birthday memorable. Yeah. That's me, Swift. Thank you. You're welcome. <laughs> that is too funny. I know you was <laughs> like. <laughs> <laughs> How did we even get on this conversation? Oh my goodness. Ooh, that is funny. I got underwear. <laughs> you got quilters underwear. Oh my. Oh my. Oh. Oh. We got the motor, the rotary blade, I remember. Okay. quilting shop in where Somewhere. we don't know <laughs> <laughs> is we, it west burlington we are a uh, hundred and no one hour 15 minutes away from the last shop and it doesn't say up on the sign up here but i'll show you the sign right there so that's where we are and that's my dear friend, Kevin. He's masking up. <laughs> we're finding, when we were at the last shop, we found that people were not wearing masks. I didn't even videotape in the shops and I probably won't videotape in any of the shops, but just letting you know about our journey as we go along. Hi guys, we are at our third quilt shop and I don't know what area we're in. Where are we, Kevin? Iowa. <laughs> We are at I don't a know. little rural quilt shop, mm. and I just thought that I would share this with you guys. We had a hard time finding it. The GPS was taking us on the other side of the street, and we had to call. But it's called Sister Craft Quilts and Quilting and More. So I will see you all later. Oh, also, I haven't bought any fabric yet. <laughs> Hi guys, we are at quilt shop number four. It's Quilters Paradise. I've been to three shops, haven't spent any money yet. As far as on fabric, I bought two of the Row by Row Experience license plates. They have very reasonable prices at the first and third shops, but I'm just trying hard not to buy fabric. And I don't have a lot of selections when it comes to the notions and tools or anything that's different yet. So that's what I'm kind of waiting for. And Kevin's got a message for you. You all would not believe this. This is a changed woman. She has not bought anything. She has exhibited great self-control. I am completely impressed. I have spent um, $11. <laughs> That's what I've spent, $11. Um, so I'm gonna show you the storefront and then we're gonna go in. <laughs> and this is when I noticed. So there you can see the... All right, guys. We are at the Needle and Thread, 
and this is one of the shops that's in the northeast region and we are here and we can't get in because they're closed on Tuesdays <laughs> and so we're gonna I'm gonna miss getting the badge for the southeast region but I just wanted to go ahead and show you guys this quilt shop anyway I'm not sure what town we're in it says Washington Iowa Washington Iowa Kevin thinks so and she's still keeping up with not buying anything <laughs> Well, this one helps me out a lot. <laughs> so we're gonna go ahead and go. I'm hoping that when I finish this Southeast region that somebody will give me that patch. So we'll see. All right, we're at shop number six. We are in Kelowna, Illinois. We're at the Stitch we're in, in Iowa. So. We're in Iowa, not Illinois. Kelowna, Iowa. I don't know if, if I said Illinois, I don't even recall because <laughs> I'm, I've been asleep. <laughs> we might be anywhere <laughs> but yeah so we're gonna go so we're gonna go into this shop and we'll see you when we come out okay so we are at Willow Creek quilt shop we left the other quilt shop I bought uh, seven dollars worth of stuff <laughs> so I didn't spend a whole lot in this shop I didn't spend anything Kevin brought a piece of fabric and um, we're not gonna leave uh, I think it's Kelowna, Iowa. So nice owners in here. Got to talk to people. Very great. All right, we are at quilt shop number eight. Eight of the day, <laughs> and we are now at the Little Red Hen. Very beautiful place. is in Muscatine, Iowa, and um, we're gonna visit this one, and then we've got one other shop and muscatine as well so we're gonna just go in see what they have to offer and then we will see you all later <laughs> before i sign off let me show you that they have like some vinyl like quilts that they have out here hanging on the outsides like it looks like a cheater cloth but it's not fabric there's one over here too and um another one right there so pretty interesting this is actually in a neighborhood as well so pretty cool so now we are at Neil's vacuum and sewing center in Muscatine Muscatine Iowa and we were talking with the ladies we've already been in this store because we were like 20 minutes before it closed and we were talking to the ladies and sadly Neil's he was over a hundred years old she says but he just passed away last week but the family still owns the store and has been running the store for years. So um, thank you, Neil. Great shop. They have a little bit of everything in here as well. So I enjoyed this shop. This one is the one that got my money. <laughs> they had some things that were on my list of things I needed, uh, projects I want to do. So I am really excited that I came to this place. So this is going to be it for as for as shop hopping for July 27th, 2021, and we'll do more shop hopping tomorrow, we are going to try to find something to eat now. So here we are at dinner at a um, Mississippi, Brewing Mississi Mississippi Brewing Company, and uh, we ordered a tenderloin <laughs> that we were going to split. They say it's a plate you can split. Now, I think, like, Four people can eat this. <laughs> this is this is really ridiculous. This is something else. But we're gonna see what we can do. But I just thought that I would share this with you. We also have some onion rings as well. And then some sides. But I'll talk to you all later. So guys, we're now looking at the Mississippi River. We came to the downtown area. We just ate at a bar and pub. Food was just food. <laughs> Nothing to write home about. There's a statue here. Not sure who this is. Let's go see. See if we can do some investigating. But nice down here. Got some people over there with children. They've got a water fountain over there. And the kids are over there getting wet. So that's pretty cool. I got to watch where I'm stepping so I don't <laughs> fall on steps. I'm falling up steps now. <laughs> I'm so tired. Uh, the time now is what time let's see my watch is on a different setting 
5.50. So the time is 5.50 p.m. Mississippi Harvest. So, Eric Blom. Got all the, the information here. Artist. Dedicated to the men and women who made the Muscatine the pearl button capital of the world. So you've got your scallops there with the pearls. Very nice. And very nice. Really tall uh, sculpture. I'd say it's at least the man's probably twice average height. Like Kevin's height. Kevin's tall. <laughs> so he's pretty big. But we're going to figure out where we're going to get a hotel room. And maybe we'll meet you all back there. Supposed to be having Tuesday live chat. We'll see if that happens. Talk to you all later.